Siobhan has been captured by Martins, and he's looking to escape. Fortunately, they're distracted by something else right now, so escape should be relatively easy. So this is a weird-looking horse. And it looks like I might want to ride it once it gets proper paw support. It's holding a round stone. Uh, I think maybe we use the stone here? Nope, nope, nope. We just have two items we can't open up yet. And we have a flower ornament, which gets used over here. Let me grab that hammer first. Ah, two items. Okay, a horseshoe. The horseshoe goes on the horse's bag. That gives me cards and a letter. I hope the magic horse will help you find and catch the one who witnessed our deal. No one can know what we're planning. Renounced! From the Alchemist Guild? Oh no! I guess that's someone we're supposed to recognize! Uh, we have this weapon and a shield. Those are both collectibles. And we want to put these cards into place for a puzzle. I think uh, the Martins were together, and an alchemist showed up, and then they left, and then they're here, wherever here is. So the code is 5726. Haha! Track down the cat who eavesdropped on our meeting! He's hiding in West Cat Village. Do not leave any incriminating evidence about this incident in your cart. Like you've done in the past. Hmm. Okay, so now we want to scare the Martins off so we can examine this incriminating evidence in the cart. Yes, so, uh, let's see. This thing goes with these knitting needles. And that goes with the round stone. And it's a weapon. I'll use it to attack the Martins. This doesn't seem very effective. We don't have time for you. There are more important things to do. Uh huh? <coughs> what was that? The Martins have magic now? Are the Martins working with the alchemists? What's going on? We first heard about the alchemists like half a second ago. Yeah, but apparently we've got magicians that are working with the Martins, and that's no good. That's no good. Hey, horseshoe stuff. Good. Uh, let's open up this cart with the keys. And this is a hidden objects challenge. Let's find everything. Uh, a patch. This... Um, the gloves, the mace... I want to use the crowbar over here. Oh, and bow. The bow is the purple thing. It's that kind of bow. Here's a Martin, and a canteen is... Help me out here, Hint. Over there! You press the down button to go down, and look at some more stuff, like a padlock and shackles. And this... We weren't able to apprehend the tailor, but we know his name is Paul, and he lives in the village of West Cat, near Catstown. You need to capture him and interrogate him! We need to know how much of our plan he's overheard! Well, Wisher. Oh man, so this tailor is in deep trouble. We have a hinge and nunchucks. Alright, let's use the uh, Martin thing over here. Grab all those items, and let's use the magic horse. Why not? We've got stirrups, we've got the reins. Let's go. Oh no! Can't really see it, but... Uh, that horse was blocking the way, I don't know why. Now you can see it, there's a fire! The town is on fire! And this is kind of frustrating, because we're just going to ignore the fire and solve puzzles instead. Oh hey, there's a collectible! Yeah, cool. So what puzzles are we solving? We need to solve this puzzle, and uh, this puzzle we need to cut that, which is strange, because I'm a cat. Can't I just use my claws to cut the rope? 
I don't know. So, sandpaper, and then this is a tile puzzle. We need one more tile. Let's look over here. We have a hook. We need to do something uh, with the wood, and I need to sharpen something with that grindstone. Oh, here's a dull blade. I'll sharpen it on the grindstone right now. Excellent. I also want to point out we have stuff that we can go fishing for, so we're going to try to make a fishing pull. Yeah, and meanwhile, the village is on fire! Why are you doing nothing about the fire, Siobhan? <laughs> okay, looking over here, we're using our sharp blade to get whatever that might be. Is that a pack of nails? It's a pack of nails, and now we have some fishing line. Do I have anything to use the fishing line on? I don't know. Hmm. Not a lot of tools here. Let's look back here. Now hold on a second. Sandpaper, a comb, and a hammer. This needs a hammer. Great. Hmm. Hint button, what do I do? Hint button says I am definitely doing something here. What is it? There's an item there? I need a few more items. Well, I'm a little confused. Is there anything else in my inventory that I can use? The hammer? The, the nails. Yes, the nails. Oh! I forgot something back on this screen. Okay, back with this horse. The horse that was blocking my view. I forgot the fishing pole on the horse. Okay, so I've got a fishing pole on the horse. I can put the fishing line there. And put the hook there. And now I have a fishing pole. Let's use the map to return to the village here. We'll go fishing in this spot. For a spool. And one of those tokens. The four tokens go here. For a puzzle. So this puzzle we want to move everything around. Uh, let's start by getting these four big ones into place. So let's see. Want to move them like this. That's how you get the big ones into place. Now these four in the middle. Let's see. Looks like I need to switch the yellow. I mean, the yellow and the blue. That's what I gotta do. Okay, so here looks like I want a yellow and a red. So let's swap this blue and yellow. And this needs to be blue and yellow. So I need a yellow here where that green is. This is a yellow. Let's swap that yellow with the green by making two moves with it. Here I need green and blue, so I'll swap the green for the red and the blue for the red. That's it! This gives us a book and a jug of water, which I can use to put out the fire. Finally, I put out the fire. Like, like, there's a bunch of water right over here. Why couldn't I have grabbed the water or done something? I don't know. Anyway, Paul's house. Paul the tailor. He oversaw something going on with the Martins and the Alchemists. We're going to find out the full story when we look at this, but we need the beetles to open it up. This is a collectible and another shield collectible. Okay, let's look over here. One beetle. Dear Paul, due to the increased number of missing residents, you're ordered to report to Catstown immediately for your own protection. Chief Guard Gustav. Well, this is strange. Usually the governor sends these messages, not Gustav. What's Gustav doing? Oh no, I hope Gustav isn't like a traitor working with the Martins. Or, or, or is he trying to stop them by saving Paul? I, I don't know. We're going to put the comb here. We're going to run it through a couple times. I need a basket or something to pick it up. Here I want to grab this. It looks like a star amulet. I put a book into place. I definitely need more books, though. One more book. Got to do it. This is a lock. I'll pick it with my lock pick. Giving me a beetle and a bag. And then everything w about this this uh, spinning wheel is broken. We're going to have to fix it. Oh, and here's a tile on the ground, which I don't want to miss. Okay, so the bag... Will be perfect for that. Oh, and it's another book. So now I've got a book in a bag. We'll put these two books there. And this is a hidden objects challenge. Kind of a clever one because we have to see outlines. So there's an axe and there's a mouse and that looks like a cat head and I think that's a boot. 
and a clover, and a feather, pressing that button there to end the challenge gives us a petal. So we might have everything we need to solve the, the spinning wheel puzzle. Let's see, we need straw, we need a spool, we need a petal. Yeah, that's everything. Okay, and that gives us, that gives us some twine and the necklace, the necklace for this thing. When I first saw that, I thought it was like a cat. I thought it was an actual real life cat hiding behind the curtain. But no, 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 it's just, just a design. Dear Paul, okay, we already read that message. Uh, that gives us some oil. I'll use the oil over here. Mm, it's dark, but I have feline vision. Ooh, that gives me a couple of items. All right, let me make sure I didn't miss anything here. I did. It was sleeping powder. Ooh, useful. Beetles go over here. Let's hear Paul's story. It was a sunny day when I went to the island to gather herbs. There I saw prints that did not belong to a cat, so I followed them. I was horrified by what I found. Guards and alchemists were negotiating with our enemies. Martins. Oh no, we've got traitor guards and traitor alchemists? I don't know if the alchemists are cats, though. Either way, with this puzzle, you want to click on the items in the picture, which are big and red. So, sunny, prince, and guards. I tried to escape unnoticed, but the Martins recognized my cloak and chased me on magical horses that the alchemists had created for them. I tried to lose them, but they managed to follow me all the way to my house. Okay, cloak. Alchemist and house. I hid in my home and kept watch through the curtains. The Martin set fire to the village, scaring away the village inhabitants. I knew that once they found me, they would capture me and shackle me. Well, it's good that Paul wrote this explanation. I wonder how long ago that was, because the fire was still burning when we first showed up here, right? So it couldn't have been that long ago. Curtains, fire, and shackles. I bet the Martins took Paul to that island. I knew that raft was there for a reason. It's Paul's raft to get to the island. So that island might be a Martin hideout, or it might be an alchemist hideout. Either way, uh, the Mar Martins and the alchemists are working together to make sure nobody knows they're working together. Uh, yeah, yeah, they're, they're, they work together to capture Paul because Paul's the only witness to their nefarious deeds. So, sandpaper on this paddle, which I carved. I've got a nice little paddle. So I have a paddle, and I have some rope. Twine, I guess that counts as rope. And now I can travel to that island and save our friend Paul! Is he our friend? Have we ever met him before? I don't think so, but who knows. We gotta save him anyway, right? He is a good cat. Paul, eat quickly. We don't have time to waste. He saw me. It's Paul. I've got to help him, but first I need to deal with those Martins, and I'm pretty sure I can deal with them using this sleeping powder. 